Blood Soap Buddy Cup. Is that oat milk? Yep. I thought you drank almond milk. No. Almond milk manufacturing is draining our country's water supply. No shit. Hey, have you seen this? Tom Hanks is in quarantine in Australia. Yeah, somewhere up north. Him and Rita are basically patient zero for this new infectious disease. I forget what it's called. It says here it's called COVID-19. Yep, that's right. And there were already 130 confirmed cases nationwide. Apparently, it started with someone in China eating a bat. Similar to the coronavirus found in bats, its origin is yet to be confirmed. Where are you getting your news from? Instagram? I think I read it somewhere on Twitter. God, this looks really intense. It's like some sort of super flu that's killing a bunch of people. Yeah, but it's only affecting older people though. Our parents are older people. Oh yeah, right. Speaking of, you owe me 50 bucks. Why? Mum's birthday. Oh shit. Why didn't you remind me? Don't worry, I put your name on the card. Nice. <laughs> what do we get her? A new Kindle. She's a pro, folks. And her daughter insisted to the gods. Yeah, yeah. You still owe me 50 bucks. I gotta go. Oh, wait, though. Don't you have a video chat with Joe tonight? Yeah. And that's what you're wearing? What's wrong with what I'm wearing? Oh, it's okay if you're going to work. I am going to work. All I'm saying is, let your hair down a little. Pretend like you know how to be cool. I can be cool. Sure you can. <laughs> yeah. Bye. Oh no! I'm still eating that. Aw, emoji flowers. How do you know? Wild guess. Can't wait to see you later. Me too. Hey, babe. How are you? Hey, hold on just a sec. <sighs> what are you wearing? Meeting some friends at Green Room 42. Another late night rendezvous with your lover from down under. You're not normal. Normal is the new basic. I am not basic. Look, I know that you have one of your special video engagements for later and I just want to make sure you're going to change. Ladies like a little effort. I don't need girl advice from you. I am a girl. Remember? All I'm saying is it wouldn't kill you to show a little cleave. Did you just say cleave? Yeah, just a little. You know, you want to give her something for her eyes to grab onto. If mom were here, she would tell you to mind your own business. If mom were here, she would tell you to show a little cleave. Oh, stop saying cleave! <laughs> but you know I'm right. Effort doesn't go unnoticed. Trust me. I'm much more worldly. Mm -hmm. Oh, would you look at the time? The least you can do is change out of that sports bra. Just got home. Call in a sec. Yay! Can't wait to see your face. Hi, you're home. I am. I'm so happy to see your beautiful face. Me too. Oof, that wine looks good. Work was a nightmare. Oh, that's weird. Sorry, one sec. Hi, can I help you? Anything good? You sent me wine. It's Friday night. I figured if we were together, we'd be sharing a bottle of wine and talking about our days. So, 
How did you even... It was actually more difficult than I thought it would be. You're incredible. You know that? I keep wishing that I had spoken to you at that party. You were all cool, standing by the bar in that blue velvet jacket, surrounded by your cool friends. <laughs> Couldn't take my eyes off you. <laughs> Wait, you thought I looked cool? Totally cool. And put together and sexy. Mm. Promise me you'll tell my sister that you thought I looked cool when you two meet. <laughs> I promise. I kept uh, hoping that you would look over and notice me noticing you. I did. You didn't, though. You're really into this star-crossed lovers scenario where you chase me halfway across the internet, but it's not accurate because I noticed you. It is accurate. I did that. Yeah, but I noticed you. Not really, though. I noticed you. How could I not? Besides, to be fair, there was a lot going on for me that night. It was my first time in New York. It was New Year's Eve. It was like, ugh, sensory overload. That's how I feel every time I'm with you. Well, not with you, with you. You know what I mean. I could get used to this. You should. This is insane. This is insane. We live on opposite ends of the world. So? We only see each other on video chat. I'm wearing my work clothes and my slippers. What kind of slippers? Well, you'll never know. You'll never know. You'll never know what my slippers look like because they're here with me and... Well, you're all the way over there. Okay, well... Let's go on a real date. You can wear your slippers. Okay, well, to be clear, I wouldn't wear my slippers on a real date. <laughs> you can bring them. We could go somewhere, anywhere. Come on, say yes. I really want to see your slippers. Say yes? Say, say yes to what? We just hop on a couple of flights and meet for dinner? Well, no, not dinner, a weekend or a week, maybe. Let's go somewhere amazing. I, I don't know. What don't you know? I'm not really the book a spontaneous trip kind of person. Well, you could be. You just decide that you are and then you are. Just like that, hey? <laughs> just like that. Look, all you gotta do is answer one question. What's that? Do you wanna go on a date with me? A proper holding hands, sitting so close that I can feel you breathe the date. A deep, soul-connected, bodies pressing into each other kiss at the end of the night date. Yeah, I really do. Okay. How do you feel about Hawaii? Hey guys, thanks for watching Dating in Place. If you don't want to wait a whole week to watch another episode, I get it. I wouldn't want to wait either. The good news is you don't have to. You can go right now to watch.reverie.tv forward slash OML and you can binge watch the first five episodes of Dating in Place for free. Queer TV. For free. Also, follow us on social media at Dating in Place for latest updates on the show. Thanks for watching and stay safe.